So my beautiful people, I am back with another Elden Ring video and today I'm going to showcase to you guys this insanely rare greatsword which is actually super powerful. This may be one for the collection or maybe one you want to be get using. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, it really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Also guys, I do apologise, I have a crazy cold, flu, I don't know what it is, killing me guys. I apologise about the lack of uploads, and my nose is running, I can barely breathe, felt so, ass is hurting, you know how it goes. But either way guys, the Iron Great Sword. Now I haven't actually levelled this up by the way, I wanted to keep it uh, at a basically a standard level for you guys so you can see it's physical attack power at a 149. Now this is by far... The most powerful I've had. I mean, it is by far the most powerful I have had. Obviously, minus the ones that have been upgraded, this thing is ridiculous. Now, you can apply an Asher War to this thing, uh, <clears throat> if that's your kind of thing, completely up to you. I mean, it will do some crazy, crazy things with the Asher War you can put on this. But hey, like I said, I just bring you the weapons, I bring you the guys, I don't tell you how to use them. I mean, and to be honest as well, great swords ain't my kind of thing, but hey, if you're into those strength, this one scales with strength and dexterity, requires 18 strength and 10 in dexterity. If this is your kind of weapon, I know there's many, many people out there that love this kind of build. And hey guys, this is how you get this thing. So, there are as far as I'm aware, about three enemies, probably possibly four, on the entire map where you can get this thing from. Now, what I will say is, the one is located within the capital. Me, I've travelled way too far, I killed Malekith within the Dragon Temple, my capital is no more. So I can't show you the location of that one. But guys, if you do have access to the, the Halic Tree area, this right here, I can show you exactly where you can farm these things. Now to get up here guys, you need access to uh, the Grand Lift of Road, which I'm sure you will have by now. If not, don't worry about this for now, guys. But hey, once you come here, you need to get the uh, the Halitri Medallion, which is one half comes from uh, Commander Nile, a bossy in Castle Soul, and the other half comes from an NPC down here. I mean, if you search YouTube for a guide, guys, loads will come up. Then, guys, you gain access to the hidden path to the Halitri. And if you come all the way up here, I'll put uh, actually. If you don't know what I'm talking about and you're confused, I'll put a video in the video description which showcases 13 hidden and secret paths. Um, it showcases you exactly how to get up to here, uh, what you need to do here, because once you come here guys, you need to go through one of those ever, go uh, ever jails, sorry, call them ever goals, it's actually ever jails. Um, and you'll have to do like a mini puzzle, a lighting for candles within this area right here. Once you do that, a portal will open up, you go through that portal and you end up right here. But hey. So yeah, that video will find a link down below. But yes, guys, once you get here, guys, which I'll spawn into, I'll show you exactly where you gotta go to from this the first grace point you'll get to, in where you can farm this enemy. Now there's two located within this area, as far as I'm aware. I'd say just farm the first one, it's way easier. Okay, so once you land here, guys, this is exactly where you're landing. We need to travel down that way. So that's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna run down here. I probably know this already, but just for people that don't. I like to try and explain everything, you know what I mean? I don't like leaving people hanging, people confused. I hate that. I hate that. If I watch a guide and I'm seeing people like in comment sections, like, what? I don't know where you're going. How do you get here? That annoys the crap out of me. So, yes, my videos may be a little longer. Yes, you may have to pull up with my annoying voice a little longer. But I do try and explain everything you need to know. Now, I've got no sound weird in my headset. I don't know if it's because it's down or what, but hey. Okay, so guys. Just run straight down here, so the path I took. Be aware of the dude up there with his great horn. Then bubbles, when they get close to you, just roll. Just like so. Otherwise, they do some serious damage. Now, there will be a couple that come towards you. Just like that, so just be careful. Don't worry about the poison uh, spores either. So, when you should come here, guys, climb down this ladder. Just like so. And uh, there's a grace point right nearby here, guys. This is the one we farm farm to do that. So. Yeah, you just want to sit down and activate this grace point. This is the, I think this may be the Hello Tree Town grace point. Let's have a quick look. Yeah, this is the grace point you want. You can also go to this one here. There's an enemy around here as well. But this one's way easier to farm. So from this grace point, guys, you just want to come down here. And at these steps here, there will be an enemy. And you need to take him out. He isn't the guy we're going to be farming. 
There's also these two here, which you want to quickly take out too. And the enemy you want to be farming will fall down from above. Now, I will say I uploaded a video the other day. Oh, there he's right there. As soon as he lands, guys, just take him out. I mean, there's a chance he may fall off the map if you're too quick. But if you, if you stand next to him, just spam that uh, weapon pickup button, you'll grab the weapon. And then, guys, you want to run back to the grace point and redo this. Just rinse repeat until you get the weapon. Now, I uploaded a video the other day showcasing I finally got the worst weapon in the game. I think this one's rare. I farmed this dude for hours before he dropped it. I tried. I've still got my, my tier helmet on. Still got probably my scarab on as well. Yep. Using all those pickled feet, mate, this thing just wasn't dropping it. Just wasn't dropping it. So yeah, now there's another guy as well which I'll showcase to you. You can actually run from this way down to him. It isn't efficient as farming this one guy uh, before you reset it at the grace, but hey, I'll show you where it is. Let him just drop down again and I'll kill him. Now this guy, like I said, he hits really hard, so if you don't hit him straight away with a combo, oh, is it just dropped me another one? Yes, it did. Wow! I'll take two. I'll take two. Nice. Okay, so there's that guy there. And then there's this one here. So you go to the Halley Tree Town plot. Actually, I should have ran because if people ain't got this unlocked. Yeah. So that's what I'm going to do. Got to do things right, guys. Got to do things right. So I'll run down here. Hey, that's two. That is two. But people, get the silver scarab as well. This is a must. I'll put a guide to this down below. This you get for defeating the uh, Mimic tier boss. So get that as well. These both give you boosts to your discovery which help obviously in regards to farming uh, when things ain't guaranteed drops when you gotta farm certain enemies it's way better so just the other guy is located down here guys so just run past all these well obviously you'll take out that guy first if you want to farm both of these run past all these jump down here just like so but like i said it's just easier in my opinion to farm the one guy and reset the grace and he's right there he is right there but the grace guys is down here so run past him, if you do plan on farming this, and run and activate the grace first. Just like so. Just like so. And from this grace point guys, you'd obviously just reset and run backwards. But I still think, uh, you know what the thing is about this one, you can surprise him and get him from behind and kill him without him spawning on top of you or landing on top of you and doing damage to you. I can kill this guy before he basically even throws an attack. But hey, that's me, and I've got rivers of blood leveled up. So yeah, it may not be the same for you. But yeah, guys, and you just run back down to the grace. Rinse and repeat. It's up to you which one you use. But hey, and there you get it, guys. That's how you get. It's ridiculously powerful. Iron Greatsword. A super rare weapon. Which, are you going to try, try and get me? Come on. Wait, I'll, I'll do you over, boy. But yep, this grace point is right there. Halley Tree Town Plaza. And there we have it, guys. And well, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like, it really helps. Add if you like what you see, want to see more out of Ring, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, my bad, you for people. I will see you on that next one.